What's up everybody? Mike from Thought That I'm Mike here with another review. And now we're continuing Gremlins Secret of the Mogwai, episode 5. So now like I said, I'm still loving this show. It's still a really good show. Now in this episode, you've got the three uh, Gizmo, Ellie, and Sam get to this place where there's these monsters, like zombies, that turn into this type of zombie that jumps and everything else they get scared you know they're they're terrified but they have to make their way through this to get to the valley of the jade they run into this little cabin abandoned cabin realize that the uh, monsters are starting to break through so they go underground and they meet the new person radish who has a, a friend that is a real radish it's interesting so now you got these guys here all waiting he's telling them don't worry not no one's ever uh, you know penetrated this area he's been hiding here for a while then you see, oh, look, now they're starting to break through. So they're getting a little worried. Sam thinks that maybe, just maybe, there's something in one of his grandfather's books that can help with this. So they start looking through the book. Meanwhile, we go back to Mr. Green's boat, where the, the gremlins have uh, escaped, and they're looking for them. Uh, a couple of them fall into a tub, water, and they start multiplying, so it's a lot more of these things everywhere. Uh, one by one, they're attacking the henchmen, throwing the henchmen overboard, and everything else and just wreaking havoc on the boat and he starts noticing this that he can you know he maybe he can use these gremlins to his advantage now let's go back to uh sam and everybody else so he finds that there's a talisman that if you put on the head on the forehead of these monsters they just freeze and it's like they die so he looks at it he creates the talisman out of paper like the grandfathers told him and they put it on one and it works so they continue, they continue, it, uh, you know, he's got to be brave enough to do it too, he was scared. So he's brave enough to actually get all this done, and they get all the talismans on all these monsters, and they get away. Radish wants to join along with them for this little, their, their, their mission, and they, they say, yes, come on with us. So Radish joins the crew. Now we go back to the boat. Now the, the gremlins are, you know, making the people walk the plank, throwing them off the board, except for the boss. Now he says, listen, what do you guys want? The leader, who we thought was a guy, is now apparently a female. Uh, they call him uh, Mrs. Claw, I think. He says, boat. So he wants the boat. And they want to travel the world and cause mayhem everywhere. So Mr. Green makes a deal with Claw, Mr. Claw, and says, I will give you the boat if you help me get my mogwai. So he says, yes. So now the, Mr. Green has the gremlins as his new henchman. He still has Sam's parents and he's using those as, le as leverage. And Sam is on his way to Vang Dong, I think, to find the key to get to the Valley of the Jade. That's episode five right there. Again, really good. Uh, I, I like it. I don't like the Radish guy. I think he's too, that's one, so far it's one thing I don't like is the character Radish. She's a little too hyper and naive. But uh, there's two scenes that I like in this. Uh, I'm going to talk about them real quick. Well, I'm going to show you guys them. Uh, one is the scene when they find out, when they realize the talisman, how to make the talisman, they start putting on everybody's head. So, check this out. A receipt. Oh, or you can only defeat them with this. A receipt from the knife store? Oh, yeah. Oh, this talisman will freeze a Jiangxi right where they hop. Just be brave, be brave, be brave. Huh? Great, I slow them down. You pin the talisman on the Jiangxi. And there you go, see that's how they figured out how to stop these zombies. And then the other scene I like is the end when Mr. Green is asking Mr. Claw what he wants. And they, there's a little bit of dialogue and you can see the gremlins are starting to learn dialogue. So check this. <laughs> ah, hello Captain, let's say Claw. Now, I could crush your uprising right now. <laughs> However, as you like, in return. Ship. My ship? What do you want with a ship? Ah, you wish to see the world. And I cannot tell what your people are doing to the Eiffel Tower, but it seems unpleasant. Yes. Fair enough. 
Get me the furry mogwai and the ship is yours, Captain Claw. Deal? And there you go. Those are my two scenes that I like in this episode. Again, episode five is still going very good. I'm very happy with this. It's a very good series. And I'm um, looking forward to the rest of it. So stay tuned. Episode six will be is out now too. So I'm going to watch that. And you'll have my review from that again too. So again, thanks again for watching. If, you have a, if there's a series that you want me to review, send me it. Send me it by email. Send me the email right over here. Or follow, put, it, put it on my social media. And I will review it. So again, thank you very much for watching. I'm Tata the Mike. Take care.